A billionaire is sentenced to death for swindling nearly 3% of Vietnam's GDP in one of the biggest frauds in history. I'll explain. Trung Mai La, the 67-year-old billionaire, was charged with fraud amounting to 12.5 billion, nearly 3% of the country's 2022 GDP. She swindled the cash from Saigon Commercial Bank for over a decade. Vietnamese law prohibits any individual from holding more than 5% of the shares in any bank. But prosecutors say that through hundreds of shell companies and people acting as her proxies, Trung Mai La actually owed more than 90% of Saigon Commercial Bank. They accused her of using that power to appoint her own people as managers and then ordering them to approve hundreds of loans to the network of shell companies she controlled. The amounts taken out are staggering. Her loans made up 93% of all of the bank's lending. According to prosecutors, over a period of three years from February 2019, she even ordered her driver to withdraw 108 trillion Vietnamese dong, more than 4 billion in cash from the bank. The cash, which weighed at least two tons, was stored in her basement. According to experts, this is one of the largest financial crimes in world history, let alone in Vietnam. She is now sentenced to death. This is a rare verdict. She is one of the very few women in Vietnam to be sentenced to death for a white collar crime. She has 15 days to appeal the court's decision. A family member of La told reporters she will.